To get started, I just added a video clip to my timeline that I'd like to zoom in on. Let's begin by selecting our clip on the timeline, and then clicking the More button. Then under Video Editing, select Pan and Zoom. Drag the Zoom In effect onto your clip on the timeline and position it to where you want to start your zoom. You can also drag the arrow between these two circle keyframes to reposition the zoom once it's already been added. Now double click the second keyframe to display this inner rectangle which represents the part of the video that's being zoomed into. Drag the inside of the rectangle to change where you'd like to zoom in on the frame. To change how far your video zooms in, just drag the corner handles. Okay, and now when I play this back, my video zooms in when the playhead hits the first keyframe and stops its zoom once it hits the second keyframe. To change the speed of your zoom, drag the second keyframe closer or further to the first keyframe. Now to zoom back out, drag the zoom out effect where you want to start zooming your clip back out. Alright, so now my clip zooms in and out, but it adds an extra zoom in between and I really just want to hold my zoom for a few seconds before zooming out. To fix this, let's double click the third keyframe to view its rectangle in the video preview. Now just drag the rectangle's corner handle so that it matches up with our original zoomed rectangle. Then double click the fourth keyframe to change how it's zooming out. Drag the rectangle with the handles all the way out so that it matches the original frame of the video. Okay, and now when I play this back, my video zooms in, holds for a while, and then zooms back out. And of course, you can change the duration of the hold by dragging the third keyframe. Or you can change the duration of the zoom out by dragging the fourth keyframe. Alright, and that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.